in this video I will show you how to solve this type of question that shows up on the Digital SAT Math section. In this question, we are given a function p and told that p of c equals 10. We are asked to find the value of p of 12. p of c is the same as p of x when x is equal to 10. So we can rewrite this equation setting p of c equal to 10 and substituting in c for x. This will give us a new equation of 10 equals c minus c squared plus 160 over 2c. Now we can solve for c. c minus c will just be 0, so we can ignore this term. Our new equation will be 10 equals 160 over 2c. Now we can multiply both sides by 2c to get rid of the fraction. 10 times 2c equals 160, or 20c equals 160. Now we can divide both sides by 20 to isolate c, giving us c equals 8. Now we can solve for p of 12, substituting in 8 for c and 12 for x. Let's write that equation. p of 12 will equal to 12 minus 8 squared plus 160 over 2 times 8. Let's simplify the right side first. p of 12 equals to 12 minus 8 is 4, and 4 squared is 16. So 16 plus 160 over 2 times 8 is 16. p of 12 will equal to 176 over 16. One hundred seventy six divided by sixteen is equal to eleven, so P of twelve will equal to eleven, our final answer. This matches with answer choice D. You can learn more digital SAT strategies like this one at prepexpert.com.